Yay, here we are again with part five, I think. Let's check where we are. In the previous episode, we conquered Eden's Flower, expanding our empire pretty significantly. So let's see uh, where we are in relation to the others here. Uh, we are doing good military power now. Yeah, we're keeping up with them. Uh, the Evas have. Uh, the Evas are really scary now, I think. They are stronger than us. So, uh, I think I'm going to. Uh, wrong. I think I'm going to actually. Uh, pump out a few more military ships to strengthen the fleets here. Let's unpause just for a bit so we can see the cash flow here. Yeah, it's it's good. I also need to do research, but let's do the um, military ships first. Uh, are we building any? <clears throat> are we building any, any military ships here? We are building two. Going to the home fleet. Mm. So, yeah, let's just wait for those. Uh, we need to do our research, of course. This one, this part of the tree has no project now. We're going to do shield reinforcement as well as queue up. Hang on, hang on. Better maneuvering. Oh no. Component prefabrication, of course. Then coordinated maneuvering. Let's go with this just for now. Uh, we're still researching the open trade network here. Uh, it will soon be done. I think we should crash it now. Crash research. Uh, spend 26,000. Hang on, what's the cash flow there? Yeah, we can do that. We should do that, really. Just to get there first before anyone else takes the bizarre uh, wonder there. Yep, that should do it. Now it's crashing. It's going three times the, the speed research speed there. Excellent. Now let's see, there was something else. Yeah, that's, that was the research uh, done. And I think I'd, I'll just unpause here. Uh, I'll check for any potential colonies. Yes, there is one in there, in the newly conquered... Uh, in the newly conquered... Uh, conquered system there. Let's check it. Ooh, beautiful continental moon. We are of course going to colonize it as soon as possible. <coughs> Our main fleet is still hanging around here. We're building something down there. I think it's a construction ship being built. Colony ship. Oh, yes, 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 of course. Uh, lots of troops. Um, Let's check what kind of a revenue we are getting from here. Tahamba, 18k. So this is actually a better planet than our uh, uh, mm, colony in the solar system. That's why I'm going to build a spaceport right here, right now. Small spaceport as well as a defensive base. Uh, here we are. Yeah. <coughs> I could also strengthen my defensive bases with more weapons, I think. I'm really hoping that this uh, this place doesn't Okay, here we are. We need to build the uh, bazaar now. Yep. That research is done, the open trade network, that's why we are going to build the uh, 
bazaar down here. Oh, we have Eva's visiting here. Inside our build wonder and trade us bazaar for 50,000 credits. Yep, it's well worth it. I always go for that. I hope no one else is building it right now, but I think I I'm way ahead of them there. Yeah, continue exploration. Uh, we have mining stations in all sorts of weird places. I'm hoping to find colonizable planets in here too, so having mining stations halfway is really good. No, these have all been explored and nothing of interest has been found. There's some kind of ruin in there. <coughs> Had that been investigated? Carida Armaments installation. Ooh. What are you doing? Why don't you go here? Explore Planet Sacrea. Armaments installation. What? What is that? Let's check it. Yeah, here he comes. Uh, should we investigate the ruins? Of course. Um, Empire-wide weapons research bonus of 100%. And yet again, this is uh, this is a volcanic planet. We really need that volcanic tech now. I'm going to research that, uh, or at least stop going in that direction because we have some kind of a high-tech research installation there and now we have this Sacrea too so let's uh, let's start going in that direction as soon as possible ocean ocean colon we need that fur no we need desert colonization first so this and this and then this and yeah, we need this, and then we can go for volcanic colonization. <coughs> That's a fair distance off, but we'll get there. I think I saw a pirate in there, messing around with uh, one of our mining stations. Uh, so we might have pirates in these areas too. Which means, uh, I think we should pump out a few more escorts. Five of them. Escorts are great because they just buzz around and take out pirates and defend the... Uh, defend our areas. Uh, this is not going well, no. And this is a really important location. Uh, and no ships in sight. So yeah, that's going straight up shit creek, isn't it? Faced beams? Yes, that's what we want. Yeah, this is going to be blown now. This is... No. Yeah, that's not... He's coming around, isn't he? Or is he leaving? I should deploy a permanent squadron in this area now because uh, I don't want to lose the Caslon source in there. I think we, at this point, we do have other Caslon sources as well. So maybe it's not a big deal, but. Uh, I don't know where my escorts are. They should be defending that. Retrofit. <coughs> no, not at this point. I want to place the countermeasures. Countermeasures as well as uh, 
face the phases on my ships now, but I don't think I have the space for them yet. At least the countermeasures could be good. Destroyer, maximum ship size 300. Uh, let's do the destroyer. Let's get the um, at least the countermeasures on them and retrofit them all. Yeah, that's good. How about the phaser then? No, that means hub and life. And... Uh, yeah. Mm, a fission reactor too. I could possibly rip out one of these. So. Should be okay, shouldn't it? Uh, hub and life. Uh, one face a camel? No, I want two. Oh, I did it the wrong way, didn't I? This would mean it would require an, another fission reactor too. up at 290 297 now so but yeah we got a few phasers on there two uh, and some blasters this should be a strong ship a bit slow still unmaneuverable but we'll get there Let's save that and start, start retrofitting our stuff here. Retrofit nearest shipyard and I want to retrofit these as well. They are going there to retrofit. No problem. Where's that? Yeah, up here. Uh, I think we have pirates in this area somewhere out here. I wonder if those are the guys. Let's check those. Um, let's check who they are. They took out my mining base now, finally. Pirates are like that. When they are set on destroying something, they won't stop until they've done it. The Dreadclaw Buccaneers. Um, I'm going to send my main fleet to take out this one uh, anyway. Uh, the, let's see who they are. The Haunted Star Corsairs. Uh, those are not the same guys. So I'd like to take out the uh, Dread. Dread Buccaneers something. What are you doing? Nothing. They are somewhere around here because uh, they don't travel that far. Anyway, I'm going to send the home fleet probably to take out that once it's retrofitted so we can test the new ships as well. Yeah, that was a pity losing that uh, gas mining station. See now, type strategic. Caslon. We have nine sources. We we're, uh, we're really not in any danger. Uh, how's the polymer coming around? Where's polymer? Two sources now. Yeah, we're pretty much set. Uh, we still need silicon there, I think. Yeah, silicon. That's what we're looking for. Hmm, any military ships about? Nope. Nowhere to be seen. The pirates left. I think this is heavily armed. Hmm, what is it? 
it's a research base, so I need to protect it. I do need some escorts in, in this area. I think we're building them right now, if they haven't been pumped out already. But I think they're being built. So I'll send a couple up here to perhaps even make a new squadron of them. Yeah, my escorts are all down here. I can see them floating about here. Escort there and escort here and here. Just being useless. I have something in here too, a research base I bet. Oh, it's a supernova. Why is it so grainy? Is that oh they are not being useless are they being down here there should be a pirate base somewhere about exploration is going rather slowly right now trade agreement with the cyborgs I will try I will try to get that they're way out here now <coughs> oh the Pohya Magloon yeah treaty refused no I wonder if the Eva would want a free trade agreement Oh, they are really powerful. They are growing every minute. We are not keeping up. These girls will really be very, uh, very much of a threat. Yeah, we're not really keeping up, are we? Oh, we have torpedoes too. Construction over here, yeah, here of course. Yeah, we're going for it. Are we still? Let's. Yeah, like that. The Austerlitz cluster. Some of these names come from my Human Revolu uh, Revolution mod. Austerlitz was a. I named it after a battle, uh, the Battle of Austerlitz, where Napoleon won his uh, greatest victory. Yeah, they're in here causing damage, but we have an escort. Let's just see. No, ah, he left. Bloody pirates. Not a lot happening right now. I'm actually thinking about speeding it up a bit. I don't like to speed up this game. Oh. Here we are. Successfully stolen the territory map of the uh, Groons. They're down here. They are um, getting bigger. So, yeah. This means that these brown guys up here, they are not the Groons. Uh, I thought they would possibly. These are more yellowish. So these brown guys, we are actually neighbors with the Mercs. We haven't met them yet, uh, so uh, we're just seeing the uh, borders of them here. We haven't made official contact. Um, I think they're in here. Um, they are quite aggressive. I'm going to put my 
explorers to cover these sectors now. Um, we are suffering from a real pirate infestation now. How's this coming up? Uh, oh, that's the transport fleet. Main fleet, home fleet. No mission. Now. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm, I'm actually going to take up that. Uh, home fleet. Yeah, full of you. Go there, take that out. That might be a mistake now because uh, I really, I really don't have the fuel to um, return. Um, so they'll be limping in. This system is really being ravaged by those pirates now. Oh, here we are, Nexus One. This is. Um, these are the um, the mercs. Powerful, aggressive, extremely aggressive. Uh, these will be causing a problem, I think. These are more dangerous than the Eva. The Eva and uh, the Mercs really dislike each other, so we we can play on that relationship. Um, I think I'd I'd side with the Eva in such a conflict. Uh, but we are going to have a serious problem right here. And I just sent my home fleet out on a far away adventure. Should I return it? Um, yeah, I should. Mm, yeah, I should. No, I don't. I won't. Decisions decisions uh, we have discovered the great beacon of the Bil Bilgareth okay uh, investigate greetings we are Ugnari refugees from far away we were driven from our blah 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 the fleet consists of some colony ships and a small escort of military ships if we want to absorb these refugees into our empire and claim their ships, then we should move towards their fleet at the Panabil Garuth. Yeah, uh, we want to absorb you. Absorbing is fun. We we would like to do that. Here they are. So let's just move to the refugee cruiser. Ugnari refugees. These are are um, of a very uh, much non-human race. Look at the ships; they are beautiful. Here we are. Here we come. Uh, here we are. Yeah. Ugnari ice planet. Yeah, that was a shame. I was hoping for actually volcanic, but. This boosts our fleet a bit, and uh, yeah, and we have a free colon uh, colony ship too, the Ugnaris of Bilgaruth. Let's deploy these. This one will be the. It's a cruiser only. Uh, this one goes to the main fleet. So does this one. Let's boost that main fleet out at Sol because I think we will have a problem in that area. Being neighbors with the mercs and all, and they're more powerful than us. It's perhaps just a matter of time before they... Oh, pirate base. We should get out of here. Or rather, we shouldn't. We should actually attack it. Attack. There. 
go attack um, the colony ship. I will. Uh, I will take a decision later on what to do with it, where to send it, if we have any ice plants about. Ooh, good weapons. Good weapons. Good shielding. Yeah, these are these ships are great. This is a good show. Yeah, these are going to the main fleet. Yeah, there we are. No problems whatsoever. some information and that will claim the capital ship yeah that's what we want to do that is exactly what we want to do now these were deployed at the yeah main fleet okay so they they will take care of themselves now I will now have to decide where to found an ice ice planet colony here mm. We have any 95% in the Procopeia Procopeia system. Ice planet has some resources. Uh, I'm going to send it there. 95% that's a good planet. It's not this. Where's the planet? Yeah, here it is, a nice plant. Go colonize. So, yeah. The uh, adventure in Bilgaruth was successful. There they go to join the main fleet. And you can continue exploring these parts. Uh, the capital ship. Hang on, I think it's this one. Move to Ubra. No, that was wrong. Um, move to here, please. Eternal Firestorm. That's a nice name. Uh, I don't know if that's the capital ship we learned about in Bilgaruf there, but let's see. Yeah, there we are. Let's see who this is. Cruiser, abandoned cruiser. That's not the capital ship. Um, there should be a little beacon shining about. Oh, there, over there, two beacons even. I will send an explorer out there uh, asap. Um, do you have fuel? Investigate. Yes. Oh, yeah. I need to check that. Uh, slaughter size uh, 341. Uh, nothing special. Nothing special. I will. Uh, I will actually. I will actually. Yeah, it's nothing special. I. I'm going to retire it. To get those. Research bonuses and this explorer do you have fuel to go in here yes you do then off you go yeah this game whenever you think things become boring or you know drawn out then something happens like that Bilgaruth Thing there something happens that uh, keeps your attention and uh, your interest uh, this galaxy is very much alive that's what the designers of the game wanted to and they have succeeded uh, oh jeez go here take those out they are blowing up our shit here oh, oh that's not fair This is the one we want to colonize. Um, I need to prepare a special uh, a squadron for 
for the defense of Eden's flower there. But um, for now, this episode comes to an end here. It wasn't really that boring, it wasn't exciting, but uh, I think we, we made some progress here. So, um, uh, well, I thank you for watching and see you next time. Cheers.